If you have a few minutes for God, just let me read this verse to you. Psalms 110 verse 1 says, Sit in the place of honor at my right hand until I humble your enemies, making them a footstool under your feet. This verse demonstrates God's justice and God's wrath. God is a very just and fair God. And if God sees that someone is treating you unfairly, God is going to deal with them. He is going to humble them. The Bible says God opposes the proud and he gives grace to the humble. So if there's someone right now who is just really struggling with forgiving their enemies or you're struggling with wanting to take revenge and fight fire with fire, this is just your reminder to just let God do what he needs to do. This is why we have to continue to pray for those who hurt us. And you have to forgive them because each and every single one of us would be lying if we said that we are perfect and we've never done something wrong. It's important that we show that same grace that God shows us. And one thing about God is God always humbles people who are doing wrong like he always will humble them god will really remove whatever it is that is making them feel so proud the spirit of pride is so so deadly to the spirit satan is the king of the children of pride is one of those spirits that really are i think personally one of the worst spirits a person can have because there's no humility in pride pride sees its own ways as right pride is is a stubborn spirit it's hard to break people who have a spirit of pride don't even know that they are being prideful that's how pride work the pride in them doesn't allow them to see that they are being prideful so it's one of those spirits that you really really have to intercede pray rebuke get deliverance from for anyone who's going through something with someone you're like man like i'm so tempted to go and get revenge i'm so tempted to fight fire with fire this verse right here is something that you need to hear like sit in the place of honor at my right hand until i humble your enemies notice how he says sit here until i humble your enemies sometimes we're like god it looks like nothing's happening it looks like they're not dealing with their consequences why does it look like they're they got away with doing evil god's timing is perfect god is patient god gives these people time to repent sometimes it is a waiting game sometimes we have to kind of we have to wait for god to move love how the lord says sit in the place of honor until i humble your enemy he's telling you to just be still till i humble them that doesn't say go and take matters into your own hands go get back revenge no that literally says sit here next to me until i humble them let god work sometimes you just have to sit still and trust that god is working because when you try to take matters into your own hands and take control of a situation you're literally saying god i don't trust you you don't know what you're doing we really have to humble ourselves and be still and let god do what he needs to do okay because god saw that he saw that person that did you wrong even the things that you didn't see god saw it and he does not allow evil to be unpunished do not wish bad on people even those who have hurt you the bible says love your enemies and pray for those who hurt you so pray for the humility of jesus to pray for those who are literally hurting you